This video will demonstrate how to embed a YouTube video into a Schoology assignment or any other Schoology location without any related videos showing at the end of the video. Here I have a Schoology assignment in edit mode. I've typed a little text here and I want my video to go right below that. So I place my cursor where I want my video to go. Then here on the editor bar, choose this insert content button, tap on that and select image media. In the pop-up window, choose from the web and then media. And then here you'll see that it now says link and embed. So now hold on to that right there and I'm going to switch over to another tab where I have a YouTube video um, ready to go. So here's a video here and below the video is the share button, the share link. So I'm going to tap on that and then here select embed. Here's the embed code here, but we need to tweak it a little bit. So I'm going to copy it. And then I find it easier to paste that code um, into a um, temporary document so that I can tweak it. Here is the embed code now um, pasted into a temporary document and I've enlarged it so I can more easily see it. Um, so here is all of the information that is required to embed that. Here you'll find the address, the uh, WW YouTube address. That's what you want to look for. Notice the quotation mark here and the quotation mark here. Put your cursor inside this quotation mark. So now you can see that I've added this little magic code here um, inside that quotation mark. So again, look for the YouTube um, H www address and just inside that quotation mark, add this um, bit of code here, question mark REL equals zero. So this stands for related videos equals zero, no related videos. Now copy this entire embed code from beginning to end, including these brackets. All of that needs to be copied. Now I'm back in my um, Schoology assignment. Place my cursor right in that area and paste um, the, uh, the new uh, um, URL, the new address with that little tweak that we did. Now you can do it in here if you want. You just have to find the spot in here, you have to scroll back. I'm using the left arrow till I can find the place where the YouTube address is. I have to keep going. And once I see it, oh, there it is right there. Then I can come over and place my cursor right in here. And you can see that that's where that got pasted. So you can definitely do it in here. I just find it easier to manipulate the um, address when I'm on a, on a temporary page. Then click insert media and you can see that this is the placeholder for the video here. I like to get rid of that extra space there and then scroll down and click create. Here's the video in the uh, Schoology assignment. You can see how it looks there. And then once you've got it in, you, in your assignment, go ahead and grab this red bar and drag it all the way, all the way, all the way, all the way, almost to the very end. And then I'm going to turn off the sound there. Go ahead and click play. Once you have that dragged all the way over to the very end here and you are checking to see whether or not the related video shows up at the end. So what should happen is when it goes, when the video plays till the very end, you should not see related videos. You should uh, see the, um, the, the beginning frame of the video showing up once again.